and a half hours later, we got the cash. you get your location turned off and snap track and ghost mode all right so it's 6 a.m and we're on our way to bismarck which is about two and a half hours away to go get ben a dirt bike surprise ben with a dirt bike that's right a really freaking nice dirt bike too yeah this is probably our best surprise we've ever done yet we made it happen really fast we were like we should surprise ben and then i was like there's this bike he's been looking at and we're like let's go get it how are we gonna do that without him knowing leave really early in the morning. We're just gonna ghost them and act like we slept in really late because we're supposed to be filming a video, a jet ski jump video today, and we're all supposed to be in Cormorant ready to go in the morning to start filming. But basically we're just gonna act like we like, like we slept in and just ghost them. I mean, we did go out last night. But yeah, yeah, and we did go out last night, so it's gonna be pretty believable. I think Ryan's gonna be the most believable. Yeah, Ryan was supposed to be with, he went, <laughs> he went out last night a little bit too hard. Anyways, we got about a two and a half hour road trip ahead of us, and uh, we'll, we'll see you in Bismarck. We'll see you at the dealership. Guys, we just found the next jet ski jump location, Double Highway. <laughs> Turn right onto Airport Road. Two and a half hours later, we got the cash. Let's go do this. Let's go check it out. Hey, Ken. I know we're giving away your four wheeler. What do you think about maybe? This little blue guy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Little fifty. Yeah. What do you think? Dope. Possibly can Maybe, surprise? We'll, should we just swap out mine and give me one of these? <laughs> there she is. Looking there very is. clean. Clean. It's gonna make a killer snow bike. Yeah, definitely. Look good on it. Yeah, Ben's gonna look even better. This thing's a Honda 450 RX. Yeah, RX. Which I believe is just a bigger tank and it also comes with a recluse clutch, so it'll be great for snow biking. But dude, this is a nice bike. This might be like the snappiest, like fastest bike up road ever. Yeah, you really put it to the, the paces of it. Well, no, I can just feel it though. <laughs> yeah, I can no, just I feel, feel it. it. Well, let's go do the paperwork. <laughs> thanks, man. Yeah, thank you. Thank Ranger. you very much. Thanks. Yeah, thanks to Harris at Full Throttle Motorsports. Yeah. That really might have even been faster than our fastest Craig Craigslist deal ever. <laughs> yeah. yeah, actually, in honor of that video, that one probably did go faster than that. I mean, we were here for 20 minutes. Yeah, yeah. that that went we very smoothly. All right, you guys, so we're back home in Cormont, Minnesota. Uh, some of you are, are probably wondering what got into us to go out and buy our friend Ben a brand new dirt bike. In order for this all to make sense, I'm gonna have to tell you a little story that starts around three years ago. How about that what? How about those views? We got 16 right now, so. This is it. We're pulling in here. Headed to uh, Fargo. <laughs> to a time when Seaboys TV was still a new idea, more a hobby than anything. Just a group of small town boys hanging out on the weekend, filming what they like to do for fun. We had a very small subscriber base and barely a fraction of the views we have now. No, like we were eating dinner and it was at 13. And it just went over 13. And it just hit 14. 
Ben was a senior in high school, interning at a local screen printing business when he came up with the idea to have t-shirts made that said Seaboys TV on them for our friends and family and some of the viewers that might want to buy them too. Oh, got some new stickers, check them out. Micah mocked up a design and we ran a pre-sale in which we were able to sell around 75 t-shirts, half of which going to family and friends in the area. After our first run of t-shirts, Ben realized that having another business printing our shirts was going to drastically cut into our profits. His solution was to start printing the shirts himself. This was extremely bold because himself and the rest of us knew little to none about screen printing. Ben was able to score us an old printing press from the early 90s for free from his girlfriend's dad, Mark. Thank you, Mark. How's it work? It works yeah. good. You want to find out? Sure. Yeah. Give us your shirt. With this and countless hours of practice, Ben was able to teach himself how to screen print t-shirts. Looking back, without Ben's vision, drive, and motivation to follow through with his idea, we would not be where we are at today. So, we have the dirt bike sitting over at Dave's shop. Yes, Jake's dad, Dave. We used to film videos over there all the time. Well, anyways, I'm gonna have Jake call me when Ben gets here and be like, hey, we're filming a video, and hopefully he takes the bait, and then he's gonna basically walk right into his brand new dirt bike. Hopefully we surprise him good, too. <laughs> So CJ and Ryan are taking Ben to the shop. I think they're just gonna be like, we're going to Jake's shop for yeah. whatever reason. Yeah, we're I don't gonna know. film a video like from back in the day. Little yeah. does he know. Brand that's, new dirt bike. That's kind of why we brought it here. So it's a little bit of a change of scenery. So we're waiting. It's easier to hide here too. Easier to hide than at the shop. He's gonna walk in and we're all gonna be standing here and we're just gonna try our best to get his reaction. Hopefully yeah. he has no clue. Cause yeah. I think we've covered our tracks pretty well. For yeah, so which was extremely it. hard. I, I honestly don't think Ben has any idea. No, I feel I like he's gonna he be so surprised. It's just fresh. All right boys, what are we doing? I have no idea. We need to figure something out. I'm gonna try and track down Jake and the other guys. It's it's quite a hassle. Hey dude, where are you guys at? Should I come over and bring the camera? Okay, perfect. Yeah, we'll be right there. Sounds good. All right, let's go. They got the peanut over there, dude. What? Yeah, dude, Dave's gonna let us drive the peanut. No way, yes, I can drift again! All right, we found out what we're going to do. Our peanut is over at Sherbrooke Turf. Sounds like Dave might let us Hoon the peanut around the turf. What the frick? It is not warm out. All right, you guys. We're back at our old stomping grounds. If you guys are true OGs, you would remember that we used to hang out here literally all the time. Dude, this feels uncomfortable right now. Like, I, know. Like, I feel like I should not be here and I don't want Dave to yell at us. Oh, oh, there. Okay, everyone get in front of the dirt bike. Oh, 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 positions. Oh, positions. Oh, you think they're in there? Uh, all right, here he comes, here he comes. Do I just, do I knock? <laughs> no! <laughs> Dave's in there. Oh, hold up, hold up, hold up, oh, hold up. What are you doing, You can't! You can't! Oh, what just happened? What just happened? <laughs> hey! Alright, he said walk in. Walk in? Yeah. Are we good? I... Wait, whoa, 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 wait, what? Wait, what is going on right now? Is that the right one? This is the one you wanted, right? That's the one you wanted? Dude! Are you guys serious? Yeah. <laughs> we went to Bismarck. No. We jumped to Bismarck yesterday morning. That's how we were being so That's weird. why we were so late yesterday. <laughs> we woke up at 5 to go out there. Oh. <laughs> My... You deserve it, big boy. <laughs> what? Wait, whoa, 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 what? Jake, baby! <laughs> dude! We were supposed to surprise you first, Jake! Dude, you've been doing such a good job jumping jet skis! No, you did a better job, man. I was literally gonna buy this bike. I was gonna sell my dirt bike to buy this. Yeah, guess what? We already now you already you got it. <laughs> this makes so much more sense why you guys were being so like weird yesterday. And like you were calling me like, yo, where are you at? And I was like, I'm literally almost here. And then I pull up and no one's here. And I was like, what? 
they get so hard on me? Where's everyone else? And then we pull up here, and I try and walk in, and Ken just goes, Whoa, 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 wait! <laughs> Yo, dude, it was the air compressor turned on yeah. as soon as you pulled yeah, like, in. Like about the to moment the you guys were walking into the door, the air compressor turned on. God damn it. Oh, well. <laughs> Yo. Dude, what is happening right now? I had no idea. What? Is happening? Dude. Who went to Bismarck? I know Ryan didn't. <laughs> yeah. Hung over. He was was me, me, Mike, and CJ went there yesterday. Dude, I'm not kidding you though. This bike is the best dirt bike it's I've ever so rode cool. in my life. It's amazing. I am, He's bro. We gotta sell merch, dude. <laughs> oh my God. Up on. Bro. Sit out the door. Kid deserves it, man. Oh, yeah. I'm so happy. He's yeah. like alone, happy to be back on a Honda, and then it's like that bike. Oh my god, you guys. Bro. I got a kickstand too. All right, one more round of hugs. Yeah, <laughs> oh my god. Bro. Nice job. Everybody, everybody just hug everybody hug yeah. everybody. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Dude, this is literally my dream bike. Yeah. How good did it feel buying this like brand new? It felt pretty good. We didn't do much of a test drive. I just hopped on and drove it up and down the road. I go, yeah, this is probably the nicest bike I've ever rode. <laughs> we're no. like, all right, we'll take it. We were Bismarck for like a solid 20 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, you guys turned off your snap locations and everything because I was like, man, this is weird. Where is it? I'm like worried. I haven't heard from Ken all day. <laughs> oh, this is nuts. Man. Wow. Oh, yeah, yeah, we definitely got to sell some merch. <laughs> Yo, real talk, boys. Hey, real talk. I, I have the best I have the best friends ever. Yeah. Like, this is crazy. Oh, hey, man. Buy you stuff? <laughs> yeah, no, strictly monetarily, you know, like, because of that. But No, but we want to say the reason we bought you this bike is because you paved the path for the merchandise on our channel, which has been literally huge. Like, we wouldn't be able to buy things like this. Any of our stuff wouldn't be possible without our merchandise, which is thanks to you for starting it and running most of it, as well as just you guys for supporting and buying it and even anyone who watches our videos. So we just wanted to buy this as a thank you to you. Shit, boys. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> All right, let's go ride. It's like starting to sink in. I didn't want to bring a helmet for him because he would have been like, why do you got my helmet? We got a lot of bikes in here now. Dude, thanks bro. Yeah. One more hug. Absolutely, I think this might be our third time hugging this video. Yeah, I think so, <laughs> man. Never too many hugs. Ryan, get out of here. I'm trying to find the new merch to wear. <laughs> All right, guys, it's only right for me to plug the merch so so the company doesn't go bankrupt now that they bought me a new dirt bike. Head on over to cboystv.com and every $5 you spend gets you one automatic entry to win. These two quads, we have wraps coming for them next week, I believe, so stay tuned for those. And, uh, oh, our Instagram, blowing up right now because you guys loved, 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 loved 
the last jet ski video. So thank you guys for that. If you are not following us, head on over to Seaboys TV on Instagram and check us out there. We'll see you next Monday. Peace. Monday. Bye. Shit you not, it turned on the moment you would have put the door. truck. It's so weird really? too, because I was like, why are they running something in there? <laughs> These guys have one fucking job. They start <laughs> running something. <laughs> like, like for real. And there's We're all just in there with power tools. And then of course he's like, no, no, no. I'm like, what do you mean you're not ready? <laughs> I've been Dan sitting here for 30 minutes getting ready. <laughs> it don't look like he's gonna slam like your arm in the door. <laughs> <laughs> he just breaks his arm.